use a skin regimen that's proposed by... People are texting me. Hey everyone, thanks for joining me for this video and review of the Cetaphil Derma Control Oil Control Foam Wash and Oil Control Moisturizer. I purchased these two products at the local CVS and I saw that the Oil Control Moisturizer box came with a $2 off coupon for any Derma Control product. Unfortunately, these two products did not work for me. I felt that even with the foam wash and the moisturizer together, I did not have any more oil control than I typically do. I even tried doing um, primer before I did my foundation, and that usually keeps me more matte, but it did not get me as matte as I was really hoping to get. The good news about these two products is that they are formulated for acne-prone skin. I use a skin regimen as proposed by acne.org. I feel that that has really helped my skin stay more clear. I used to get, in fact, I still get the cystic acne that's under the skin. You can't pop it. It's a big, large bump. It's very uncomfortable and it's very obvious, especially if you wear makeup. You can see, okay, that person has a zit on their chin. And for me, you can even see some of my scars down here. It seems to be so bad on my chin. I really lean towards products that are made just for acne prone skin. These two, considering the price, I don't remember exactly how much I paid. I think one was 10 and one was 15, but I did not feel that it was worth it for me. I feel that you're better off using just regular cleanser and um, a lighter moisturizer. I totally just got rid of my husband's laundry basket that was piled up dirty clothes right there. Sorry about that. I did want to recommend a product instead of the Cetaphil oil control, whatever doesn't really work for me. The product that I feel is a game changer for people with oily skin is this oil control mattifier by Murad. I hope I'm saying that correctly. I think that that, that is really a, a wonderful product for people like me that get shiny within three or four hours of applying full face makeup. I've done everything I possibly can to keep my skin from looking like the oil slick that it really is, and this is the only thing that has helped me make that transition into normal skin, if you will. So I think that this is way better. As for this oil control, did not control my oil. So if I'm gonna spend $25 on two products together, I really want it to work. These did not for me. So hopefully if you're considering buying them, you'll think twice. Thanks for watching and subscribe to my channel if you like. If you have any more requests for product reviews, please let me know. Thanks for the thumbs up and I'll see you soon.